Okay, so here's the difference. Uh, the difference between standard and non-standard states. Think back to equilibrium. Q versus K. Okay? If you vaguely remember this, this Q can be any value. So we calculate Q based on initial conditions, and we find out what it was. A big, small number, whatever. K is not any value, it's a value for a given reaction. This is any value for a given reaction. When Q equals K, it happens to be equilibrium. But Q can be smaller than K, bigger than K, and that tells you which way it shifts. You vaguely remember that concept? Okay, this concept carries through all these new things. So let's again do one more old one. Delta G versus delta G standard. This is a value for any reaction. A value, and that value is not going to change as long as the reaction doesn't change. But delta G can change analogous to Q. This can be any value for a given reaction based on initial conditions. So this one's like Q, the standard one's like K. Okay, let's go a step further uh, and do our E versus E standard. In the same way, this is a value for any reaction. Get this from the table, okay. right? And that's never going to change because the table doesn't change. So for a given reaction, you have a value of E standard. However, that doesn't tell you about equilibrium. You calculate this to find out, oh, it's positive, it's spontaneous. Or it's negative, it's not spontaneous. This might give you a hint, but there's more in the equation than, than that. So this is analogous to Q, if you want to think about it this way. These are specified particular conditions, a particular reaction. This can be anything based on initial conditions. Conditions change. So these always change over here on the left hand side. Is that a little more helpful? Yeah, yeah. So. Okay. And standard means like standard condition, standard temperature, that sort of thing. Okay. Yeah, is about so, this? Yeah. yeah. So if, like your delta G and your E, if they were in the conditions of standard, would they be equal? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they would be equal if okay. you were in standard conditions. Um, yeah. Just by chance. Yeah, by chance. Okay. That's never going to happen. Though. Yeah, I'm just, just wondering, totally though. Totally right, yes. So what do you basically say is going to be E cell? And these are all, yeah, yeah E cells. <laughs> If it doesn't say cell, probably it's for a half reaction, but sometimes the cell is assumed. That's why I don't always write it. Oh, okay. But if uh, it does say cell, then it's for the overall. Yes, yeah, so for the overall, if it says cell. But there can be, like your book uses E standard redox, mm -hmm. a, a reduction, I mean, and E standard oxidation. Oh, okay. And those are like from the table. Uh, the table lists the reduction ones. If you flip it, that's the oxidation ones. 